I came from Joliet. It's a blue collar town. You're instilled a work ethic in you that that tells you, you know, you're not done until the end of the day. And then the end of the day just means that you get to spend time with the people that you care about and the next day you go back to work. And I always approached comedy in that sense, that there was, that there was, it was, it was still work. It was really fun. It was the best job. It's like that song, um, Rock Superstar by Cypress Hill, you know, and there's that one guy who's talking, <laughs> Because they have the chorus, you know, and Be Real is rapping, and then it kicks to, like, people that work in, in rock and rap. And that one guy's like, you know, it's a fun job, but it's still a job, man. So it's like that. <laughs> <laughs> Just like that, uh, that theme park ride that the uh, video is set on. Oh, yeah. You, wow, you remember the Rock Superstar video? I remember the Rock Superstar video. Tim, this is why I have this job. <laughs> well, I remember it too. Can I have this job as well? Yeah, I mean, would you, do you want to trade? <laughs> sure, yeah, yeah. Should we, we should we switch seats? Yeah, we switch. Okay. Um, so, yeah. you're, you said you were five episodes into Shrink. Yeah, I'm five episodes into Shrink. Great, okay, all right. Uh, how did you feel about making those first five episodes? Uh, it, you know, it was, uh, it was really fulfilling to me to, to be able to work with a lot of my friends from, from the Chicago scene mm -hmm. and sort of, you know, uh, get to show my city, you know, because when I was a kid and I'd watch TV shows that were set in Chicago, I didn't really feel like they looked like Chicago, uh -huh. you know? Uh-huh. Yeah. Enough of that. Okay, so <laughs> who is your favorite friend in these first five episodes that you made? Um, ooh, that, uh, that is a good question. You know what? I, I think I, I, I'll go with T.J. Jagodowski. Yes. Yeah. Very good answer. Yes. Yeah. yeah. You know, it was like I've always wanted to be in those Sonic commercials with him. So mm -hmm. doing those uh, improv scenes in the garage was like, it was like my version of being in the Sonic commercial. Yes, enough of that. Uh, have you have you ever seen him live in something like TJ and Dave? Uh, I, I have. Uh, only once though. You know, I've been, I've been in this uh, city for a long time and the only time I ever saw TJ and Dave live was in Austin, Texas before I moved to Chicago. Really? Yeah. What year was that? Uh, that would have been maybe 2008, 2009. They were promoting the, the documentary, uh, Trust Us, This Is All Made Up. That's right. That uh, Alex. Um, yeah. Uh, gosh, what is his name? Karpovsky. Karpovsky. Yeah. Made, yeah. Uh, he's gonna have an interview in the AV Club pretty soon about girls. <laughs> and I bet it's gonna be a banger. <laughs> and scene. All right. <laughs>